All right, I'm here. Um, I'm going to look at a couple of quick uh, paragraphs or articles called them from the Korea Week. It's a free paper I pick up from the H Mart. Uh, and we'll look at this one here and this one. I haven't read these yet, so this is me first uh, taking a first look at it uh, on this video. But first, I wanted to say. Um, What's challenging for me, what makes it a little hard, is I can read all of these words, I can read, but I'm spending a lot of time not understanding because I get one word I understand, the next two, three, four, five, six, I don't, and then I see familiar words, um, and words that I don't know, words that I've heard before, but I really don't know them because I haven't studied them. And this is one of the challenges I've found with increasing like the language uh, learn you know when you want to acquire a language and it happens slowly I've there's words that I can see today that I know what they mean that a year ago I didn't understand and they were difficult just like this so let's go ahead and go through so here we have let's see what this says starting in the top of the black there has Kingum Chindan Shiriz, Shiriz. It looks like Shiriz. So maybe that's the author's name. Kin, Kingup. Is that Kingup or Kin? Yeah, Kingup Chindan Shiriz Sam, I guess, the third series. Yuchon Cha Chojak Shikpum Ku Kong Poi Mogori Mokuri. Mokuri, I think, is like a necklace. I'm guessing it's like uh, Mokuri is necklace. Yu Chon Cha Cho Chak. I can read that, but I have no idea what that means. This saying here. Shik Pum. Shik Pum. Shik Pum sounds like somewhere you're going to eat. Shik Tang is eating. Shik Pum. I'm not sure. Gu Kong. Mokori. We hey song Bulgu Uri Shiktak Chamrong Hanguk Shik Pum Do Muguan Haji Ana. Okay. I have a general idea. Shiktak is eating restaurant. So this here is um Shiktak, right? And so Hui Hei Song, I don't know, Bulgu Uri Shiktak, our restaurant or table or kitchen, maybe. Chom Rong Hanguk Shikpum Do. Korean Shikpum is maybe foods. Mu Guan Hajiana. Is not doing something. It's an hajiana means it's not doing it. I guess I'm guessing on a lot of these. So it's something related to foods. We can see the picture here, uh, where there's like a I don't know. That's an orange and an apple. Looks like stapled together, and that looks like a f a fish and some carrots and stuff. But I I don't know what else this means. Um, I would have to look up a lot of these words and then try to guess. So let's read it again. We started here. Kin kup chin dan shiriz sam yu yu chon cha cho jak yu chon cha cho jak shik pum. Maybe this means mixed foods. I'm guessing. I don't know. Ge kong boy mo. Gori, mogori, Mo, not the, oh okay maybe this isn't this isn't a necklace this looks like maybe mogo so eating the kong boy mogori mogori something about eating we hei song bulgu uri shiktak chom yong hanguk shikpum do uh, Mu Guan Haji Ana. 
I'm going to pause it and then try to go find some, well, I guess I can't pause it. I was going to pause it and go find the words for this. Uh, let's see, let's start reading this article, see if this helps us at all. Chinan Owal Cho, Connecticut. So, last May, something about Connecticut. Yes, Chinan Owal Cho, Connecticut. Jue Wee So, Noon Yokyo Boji, Anamyon, China Chil, Subake. Subak, I think, is a watermelon. Subake opening Ili Isota. Is Subak watermelon? Oh, I'm not sure. Connecticut Jue We Connecticut the town of Connecticut. I think that is Jue We Han Kyung We Han We We Won We We Won Changin Richard Richard, Richard, maybe that means Richard, let's see, Richard, Richard Roy, sounds like a name, I guess, Richard Roy, we won a, we we, de pion inin, Christopher, Christopher, looks like a name, Christopher Donovan, Christopher Donovan, I guess, Christopher Donovan, we won Gua Hamke GM Yu Jonja Jojak Shikpume Pyoshirer Yoku Hanen Bob Bobol Che Che Kong Haro Hechiman Musa and Detta. Wow! See, even here. In this entire paragraph, I think you can hear, I can read through it like the letters. That's kind of uh, the part you learn over time. But out of, it's about maybe 40 words here. I understand, like Chinan is before, Owal, I understand, is May, Connecticut, I'm getting, you know, that looks like Connecticut. Connecticut Jewie, Jewie, we are so, so maybe this is Jewish, the town, I think, or city. Noon is probably eyes or snow, I don't know, Yokyo, Boji, Animyon. So out of these 40 words, I understand, I probably know 20 of the words, but the rest I don't, so I can't, I can't explain what this short paragraph is saying. If you know and you're studying Korean or you speak Korean and you can read and understand this, that is just amazing. That's where I want to be able to get to, but my vocabulary is limited and I'm trying to grow it by reading. So I spend a lot of time, and this is one of the things I spend time reading in Korean and because I've been reading now for years, but I've been focusing on trying to read, my vocabulary is growing, but it's, it's growing at a slow pace. So articles like this and things like that is taking time, but I am seeing progress, right? I see like shikpum, I can kind of guess that might be related to food, and this is probably mogori which is um, eating probably, and I can see things like Connecticut or Richard Roy, so I can, I can pick out names, Christopher, right? So that shows I'm increasing. And this is what we have to do with language. We just have to get in front of it and do a variety of things to try to increase our, our knowledge uh, on the words and make it um, understandable to us so that we can keep going. So I'm gonna stop here and I'll spend some more time trying to read through this article, see if I can get at least some point out of it.